things you need to know about Raphael. He's almost home night closer than a kiss. His favorite color is blood, and he probably knows a thousand ways to kill us. This Time slows for a moment, and the air becomes thicker. The master of the house is coming. There are many things in your world that I loathe. Litters of kittens, chattering children, the noise and the chaos of it all. In my world, in my house, there is order and there is decorum. You came here uninvited and you stole from me. In doing so, you brought the chaos of your world into mine. I will not abide it. Sister, oh sister, I've wept and I've cried, but all would be well if you were by my side. Oh, Hope, you are such a piteous thing. All it takes is a crumb from the table and you forget the centuries of starvation. This insolence has earned you centuries more. Carilla, tell our unwelcome guest about your role in their tragic downfall. I permitted you the freedom to decide your own fate. You could have been smart selfless, saved the world. Instead, you came here and risked everything. It's the fatal flaw of mortal kind. Take away their free will and they call you a tyrant. Allow them to indulge it and they become tyrants. You would have been heroes if you'd only dealt fairly with me. Instead, you're not so different to doomed Carsus, overreaching your limits and burning your world to Wrong! 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 They will save their world and smash you to smithereens! It's this charming naivety that makes your company such a joy to me, Hope. I'll even forgive this little rebellion once you're suitably chastised. This isn't a rebellion. It's a revolt. I'm revolting! <laughs> then hope dies today. Commander, you can salvage a trophy from these insects when I'm done with them. Gladly. To stand against a devil in his own home. Hmm. That takes courage. I'm with you. How tiresome. Am I to understand that you wish to die with them? I wish to fight with them. It's all the same in the end. If you have any last words, make it quick. It will only take a moment to finish you. As do I, little mouse. <laughs> your flesh, my supper. Your blood, my wine. Your soul, my plaything. Now, down comes the claw.
effect in the cause. Curtain falls, but hold your applause. But now, now, here come the claws.
That's what happens when you choose the losing side, Orthon. It's absolutely preposterous that any of us are alive. Maybe we're not. Pinch yourself and check we're not dreaming the last of our lives as we die screaming! Then we're not just fine, we're spectacular! What a wonderful, jubilant, glorious day. Huh? But my poor sister, Carilla. It is not right that she died. And that makes me want to weep an ocean. You don't know the half of what she did. When we were children, she always kept the last piece of pastry for me and bloodied the nose of the bullies who pulled my hair. She was my sister. But as a wise woman once said, there's no point in crying over spilt blood. We must go on. And despite all the years I've lost, I have enough love in my heart to guide you home. For the first time since you heard her voice, hope seems calm, and the peace flows from her into you, soothing your very soul. And go where? I don't think I quite know how to be anywhere else but here anymore. With a lick of paint and a thorough cleaning, this could be a lovely little house. And I can hardly leave. After all, who would ever want to think of hell without... I hope I'll see Carilla again one day. And that she'll say sorry. And I'll tell her she's forget. I hope I find all the pieces of my mind that fell out of my head over all those years. And that I'll be able to put myself back together again. I hope the echoes of pain will fade, and memories of sorrow will die, and that you'll visit me here someday. And I hope you have a happy ending of your own.